Hi guys, it's the RPG Brit here and welcome back to my Let's Play of Tales of Arise. Um, so let's watch this By the way, before we get going. What's Mahavar doing? Uh... <sighs> Wait, don't tell me we still haven't found him. It's not like we haven't been looking. I've covered the whole length and breadth of the coast, but... All of the other the, crew um... members are accounted for, including yeah. us. But we weren't able to find Mahavar. He's still missing. I see. Perhaps he couldn't bring himself to abandon the ship. <laughs> you mean at the bottom of the ocean? Damn it. We don't know that it sank. We all washed up on the same shore. If the ship went down, isn't it strange we haven't come across a single piece of debris? Do you think he might still be alive somewhere out there? I think stranger things have happened. That's Whether definitely he's alive true. Or otherwise. We've exhausted all the avenues available to us. All we can do now is press on ahead. Fine, let's get going. Thistledum the Hidden Village. Thistledum was founded by Danon's fleeing... Thistledum, not Thistledum. <laughs> right? But when you first came, they must have known Dohalim was Renan. So why do you think they let us in? They almost didn't. But it wasn't just Dohalim they were wary of. They didn't trust any of us. Even the weird Danans just like them? When you live life in constant fear of being pursued, it's only a matter of time before all outsiders start to seem a potential threat. I suppose that makes sense. So how did you convince them to trust us? You saw how destitute the village was. They needed food, badly. We hunted some Zoogles for them. That seemed to do the trick. Of course, a little magic-assisted roast didn't hurt things. <laughs> Never underestimate a full stomach's ability to put a person at ease. It turns out a hearty meal can be a powerful weapon. Beyond Vengeance? How many more of these are going to have to watch before we get going? Something's on your mind. You having second thoughts about rescuing Xion? Of course not! Xion's our friend! Almadria was the one I hated. For as long as I can remember, she served as a symbol to me of everything Renin. But ever since getting to know Xion, I realized it doesn't make sense to group people together like that. Every individual is different. I see. Besides, the situation with Almadria was something else entirely. I'd already decided I wasn't going to kill her, but when I saw her die right in front of me, a part of me thought it served her right. That she'd gotten what she deserved. But another part regretted that someone else had come along and killed her instead. Don't get me wrong. If I had the chance again, I still wouldn't kill her. But it's not like I'll be shedding any tears now that she's gone. Mm. <sighs> it's all so confusing. I don't know how to make sense of any of it. Who said it had to make sense? Huh? Rinwell, you've done nothing wrong. You've started to question the beliefs you've held all your life. It's only natural for you to feel disoriented. You didn't give in to the hatred you felt for Almadria. You made a choice not to kill her. And that's significant, whether you realize it or not. As for what it means exactly, that might be worth taking some time to figure out on your own. Some time. Or don't, if you don't want to. It's just an idea. I'm still searching too, remember? No, you're... I think you're right. It can't hurt to keep searching after all. And hey, thanks, Kisara. All right, cool. Let's, uh, let's pick up this side quest. This guy does not look happy. Okay. You people know, know how to fight Zuggles, yeah? Because I've got a big what? favor to ask. You do indeed appear to be in dire straits. I could have sworn we've already wiped out all the Zoogles that were trying to get into this village, though. <sighs> oh, you did. These Zoogles aren't trying to attack us. They're stealing our fish. Your fish? Yeah, these ape Zoogles, they've got huge arms, which they use to smash the surface of the water and create these big shockwaves. They do that to stun the fish, which makes them float to the surface and ripe for the taking. Somehow they learned how to do that recently, and they've gotten damn good at it because it's making the rest of us mm. go hungry. That's quite what? a pickle you're in. Damn straight it is. 
ain't like these fish growing trees. They're sort of fishing. That sort of fishing ain't good for our waters. So. Oh, so that's your point of of um, contention. The manner in which they fish, not the actual fishing part. You guys are the only ones that have what it takes to drive those crazy monkeys out. Can we count on you to help? Okay. Yeah, of course. Absolutely, we'll sort out these fishy fishing zoogles once and for all. I couldn't have put it better myself. As a fisher herself, this case has gotten her quite fired Great up, as you job. can see. That's mighty kind of y'all to help us out, ma'am. Sorry to lay this on your feet, but we greatly appreciate it. Fishing friends. I'll teach these small fry who's the apex predator of these waters. Right, Just so wh where would they be? They're not down here, so hopefully they're just on. We'll just encounter them on the way. All right, cool. So, oh, actually, I need to mark it, don't I? Obviously. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Uh, where do we, where do you see all of our our quests? Selves now. I guess we're having fish for dinner tonight. Huh. I actually cannot remember where we see all of our quests. Items, arts, equipment, skill panel, strategy? No. Outfits? No. <laughs> Field guide? No. And then system is just save. Status? Huh, that's going to bug me because I actually cannot remember. Oh, right, let's just carry on for now. Hiking through the jungle. It feels like I'm melting. Calaglia was pretty hot, but at least the air there was dry. Out here, it feels like I'm trying to walk through thick soup. Mm. I can hardly breathe, it's so stuffy. And don't get me started on the insects. You hanging in there, Hoodle? Probably eating them, surely. It's brutal, all right. I can feel my energy being drained away just by walking. All this vegetation makes it hard to keep an eye out. Keep your wits about you, everyone. And watch you don't keel over while you're at it. <laughs> What's needed at times like these is a relaxing hot spring. That would soon help us adjust. And where do you expect us to find one of those? What about you, Alfin? All that gear, and you hardly seem to be breaking a sweat. Yeah. I guess when you've lived a life devoid of pain for as long as I have, even feeling hot and bothered could be a welcome change. Well, lucky you, I guess. Just don't expect us to carry you when you pass out. <laughs> right, so. Quite a big area. I'll do a couple of fights. We've also got a fishing spot there. I'll do a couple of fights and then I'll um, I'll clear the rest of this area. Uh, uh, that looked like an owl zoomed right out for some reason. Uh, but no, that's a campfire and stuff. Okay. Yeah, and then I'll clear the rest of the area uh, off camera. Fast travel point added, nice. Let's get these. Now you see what I can do. Nice. Small, but a victory nonetheless. We have a long way yet to go. Sweet, right, so I'm going to do that now. I'm going to clear this area. As always, if there's anything interesting happens, then I'll start recording again. But if not, I'll see you as we're leaving. So all the way here. Yeah, cool. I'll see you in just a sec. Right, so the area's been cleared. And we're just going to go over this 
bridge, which I was just What's guessing up? was going to trigger Once something. Once we get to the mountain, the terrain won't be easy. We should rest up here before pressing on. But what about Xion? She's waiting for us. All the more reason to conserve our energy. Exactly. Huh? We need to do it properly. It's not only the mountain. Hard though that may be, it's a pittance compared to what follows. Namely, Volron. We wear ourselves out now, or worse still, get injured. We might as well show up gift-wrapped. Right, Kisara? That's right. Besides, Alfin still hasn't fully recuperated yet. I'm fine. Don't stop on my account. Oh, really? Well, in that case, it's me who wants to take a rest for a while. Does that suit you better? <laughs> a little bit. Oh, wow, look at that. That is awesome. I'm glad I looked now. <clears throat> right. Oh. Are we going to rest up now? So, Alfin, 300 years, huh? Care to share the secret to hmm. such a long and healthy life? I wish I knew. Once I left Lenegas, the next thing I remember is waking up in Calaglia. Everything in between is a blank. You mean, there are still gaps in your memory? I've heard of starships with devices that can stave off imminent death by putting their passenger into a deep sleep. They're usually yeah. only intended they must have been kept in some sort of stasis. Solution, until proper treatment for an ailment or injury can be obtained. You think he might have been asleep in that starship for 300 years? But why? What would be the point? Might this Naori have had a hand in it? What do you mean? If she's Renan like you say she is, she would have understood how to operate the starship better than yourself. <laughs> You're saying she deliberately put me to sleep for 300 years? Dohalim, that's a bit of a leap. Forgive me, I spoke out of turn. I'm merely thinking aloud, that's all. Shion and the maiden Naori. After 300 years, it's not unreasonable to suspect they may be related. Shion is nearly the perfect image of her, yes? She also just so happens to be connected to you. Is it merely a coincidence? <sighs> like I've told you a million times already, I wouldn't know. Well, if you're absolutely certain that it couldn't have been Naori, then I guess I must have been mistaken. Complicated machinery can sometimes break down or have failures. Sorry for being presumptuous. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on a sec. Alfin. You said the mask was to placate you, right? To keep your guilt and rage in check? And you were wearing it the whole time you were asleep, right? I guess I must have been. So that's 300 years you were wearing it. It's just a hunch, but do you think that the mask might be... The reason he lost all his memories? All but a select few strong ones. So deeply ingrained in his psyche that he saw them in the form of dreams. It's not completely out of the question. In which case, maybe it was the mask numbing his sense of pain, too. It's certainly possible. As for how, I wouldn't know. But the dampening effect on his psyche could have manifested itself physically as well. <sighs> I'm sorry for snapping at you back there. It's thanks to you that I feel like I'm... No, that we're finally getting somewhere with all this. No apologies necessary. Reading others' feelings has never been my strong suit. So he finally admits it. Hmm. I really hope Xion's okay. I get why you're concerned. But if you don't rest when you can... Right, let's cook something. Um, I noticed when I was doing some levels that there's certain things that we need to cook to actually unlock um, those skill panels. And one of them, I think, is ice cream. Uh, so I'm going to do this. Uh, elemental attack. Uh, reduces effect by 20%, but boosts the duration. Yeah, that's fine. Mm, good food is <clears> the <throat> best kind of magic. And one of them was making ice cream, I think. So we'll see if that mm, unlocks this something. Ice cream tastes so good. I swear, you're always having ice cream, even when it's freezing cold out. <laughs> and who made you the food police? No one. I'm just saying that's a lot of ice cream. Don't you ever, you know, throw up or anything? Did you really just say that? 
Try thinking before you talk. Huh? W what do you mean? All I'm saying is I'm... Uh, I'm just a little worried about you, okay? Well, don't be. I can have ice cream whenever I want. You say that, but you know what's gonna happen if you keep eating ice cream all the time. It's none of your business what I eat or how often! Arguing over the consumption of a frozen dairy product. Ah, to be young. Naive might be more accurate. Yeah. Well, I didn't know it was actually going to unlock um, some dialogue as well. But that's pretty cool. It makes me feel like I should cook different things from time to time. I look at him up on his throne. Sugar connoisseur. There we go. That was the one that unlocks. So if you if you hover over some, it tells you sometimes. Yeah, advanced subquest, uh, novice solo training grounds, items collected. I don't know what items that's meant to be. And this one's owls, I believe. Yeah, owls met eighty percent. So Let's yeah, go. I'd have to. <clears throat> don't want to keep Shion waiting. Have a proper look at those. Right. Let's watch this. I always hear you muttering to yourself whenever we're in battle. So. uh just what I'm guessing it's say? incantations. Why do you want to know? Does it bother you or something? Not really. It's just the way you talk is sometimes kind of creepy. So I was wondering if you vent your frustration through your magic. Are you yelling, you stupid jerk, or something like that to pump yourself up? What? No, that's not what's happening during my incantations. I'm just focused, so I match my tone to fit the mood of whatever I'm trying to invoke. Invoke? Uh, how do I put it? Basically, the elemental astral energy behind each art, I guess. Astral energy? Hold on, are you saying you can talk to astral <laughs> energy? Uh, not exactly. But if I put emotion into what I say, it's easier for me to properly cast my arts. That makes sense? Kind of. Okay, so if you can talk to astral energy, then you can ask it to, like, predict the weather or find secret treasure? Wait, you don't really think that, do you? Or you can ask it to send out lightning to where there's bad guys lurking and... May lightning condemn those who bear false Thunder blade! Ah, what are you doing? <laughs> you almost fried me with that! I just asked the astral energy to send down lightning where there were annoying boys. Come into terms. I don't know what to do. Things can't go on like this. What do you mean? Ah! Oh, it's you, Rinwell. You were talking about me, weren't you? No, I wasn't. I've just been thinking about some things. Really? How unusual. Cut it out. I'm being serious here. Uh, sorry. I was thinking about... You know how I used to work for Ganabelt back when I was in Cislodia? Yeah, of course. You were brought in after the Snake Eyes killed your friends, right? I mean, you had to. Right. I used to have nightmares about it when I fell asleep. But lately, that's been happening a lot less. I don't know how to feel about that. That's a good thing, isn't it? You should be happy. Yeah, but... <sighs> I did a lot of terrible things back then. And I'm scared I'm starting to forget what I did. Okay, so let me just get all of this straight. You think you'll forget everything if you stop having those nightmares? Why? Because... You know me. I'm freaking stupid. But it sure doesn't sound to me like you've forgotten. Oh, well, yeah. But still. I don't think those nightmares going away means you've forgotten. Maybe it's a sign that you've come to terms with what you did. Come to terms? You mean like Alfin with his past? You think that's what's happening? Yeah, I do. <sighs> You're pretty amazing, Law. I am? Wow. Yeah. 
Not all of us have figured out how to accept our pasts. Least of all, me. Rinwell. Alright. Let's uh, see what we can do here. Forge weapons. Uh, oh, nearly. I need one more tentacle for that. Uh, nothing there. I can do this. Supreme winged gauntlets. Let's do that. Ice stone. It looks like ice stone is quite a common one that we're going to need. Yeah, ice stone again there. Okay, cool. Um, bye. Let's see if there's any armor that's going to help us. Yeah, all of it. Awesome. Let's get it all. Sweet. Anything else? Just consumables. Okay, that's fine. Uh, oh, and one thing that happened with our ranch is that we can now do sheep. And also, we've now got four slots, which is quite cool. Uh, I'm still just giving them normal feed, though. There we go. Have you guys checked your equipment lately? All right. Let's move on. There's some ruins we've got to go into, maybe. That's what we're going to climb? The villagers managed it on the... ...their escape from the city. We're going in the opposite direction, but... ...where there's a will... <sighs> There's always a way, right? And it looks like we're out of options. Let's grit our teeth and go. Awesome, let's watch this first and then we'll, uh, we'll head off. Or does Rinwell suddenly seem much more comfortable around Dohalim than she used Wasted to? Wasted up to them, I noticed didn't they? Too. When the two of them came and found me together back on the beach, I could hardly believe my eyes. It's not like we had a choice or anything. Law and Kisara had to hang back to convince the villagers we meant them no harm. More than that, though, there are a lot of things I've still got to come to terms with regarding Almadria. But I guess I'm through making snap judgments based on someone's origin. At least, I'm trying to be. I guess you could say it's a work in progress. I see. You hear that, Law? Sounds like all that hard effort wasn't for nothing. <laughs> yeah. That's got to be reassuring to hear. Right, Dohalim? Not being subjected to unwarranted suspicion is certainly welcome. Yeah. Why do you always have his hand across his way you have chest talking, like that? Though? Not so much a fan of that. I think that's more of a personality thing than a Renan trait. Really? In that case, I won't have to feel guilty getting annoyed by it. <laughs> <clears throat> awesome. Right. Let's carry on. Oh, maybe we, this is where we can get these ice things from. Oh, I'm not actually sure if I've seen that one. That's pretty cool. I still got a ways to go. Ice stone, yes. So yeah, this is how we do it. All right, cool. I could just leave this there and keep coming back, just to get all the ice stones I needed. This injury hurts more than I thought. Shion, sorry, but could you? She's not here. Oh. I'm guessing we're going to come across a lot more of those. So 
So I'm not gonna farm. Oh, there you go. Hold other area. Shame the fight isn't inside the cave. I only just noticed that. We're like out in the open, but that's not where the fight was. this way first aha more of these hopefully we'll get some more <clears throat> of those items Be that one. Oh, both of them nice. Good to know my training is paying off. It'll be a breeze. Get in, get out. Do that one. This should make for some good weapon crafting material. Well, hopefully, so I wouldn't mind getting better weapons all round. There's quite a few options we've got. like this before I bet it'd feel real refreshing to take a shower underneath this water you're welcome to try but that water pressure would likely crush you to a pulse. I was just thinking that that's gonna hurt there's one thing the variety of enemies that like it doesn't seem that great they could have had different, completely different animals in each area, but it's just, it's just different variants of the same animals over and over again. Which is not, it's not, you know, massively bad, but I think I, I would have preferred just completely different monsters. Or Zoogle, shall I say. Let's 
refrain from losing. Good idea. Seriously? Cool five of them. You picked the wrong fight. I'm on it. Look at the demon fang. Bloody howling. Ready to resonate with the earth. Blue escape. Double team attack. Look. Look sharp. Lightning tiger blade. See that? That training's paying off. No further. You're on it. You're finished. This one's mine! Can you take it back? I'm ready! I'll stop your movement! And I'll stop your life! An actual art? That's my cue! Shut him down! Shut him down. It's over! The double demon crash! I'm on! I should be of some use to us now. You were More exactly ice stains again. Before. Except in regard to doing basic chores. Ha! <laughs> Burn. Right, cool. So, I'm actually going to end this video here. Um, I'm going to keep advancing up. Um, and when I get to the top, that's when I'm going to actually start the next video. Or when something happens, obviously. Um, but yeah, cool. Thank you very, very much for watching. That looks really weird this far away. I know it looks better now. No? You can still kind of see it looks very odd. Um... Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't already, please give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much, and take care.